to Indian Stadium in Tuscola. And this would be a good one. We pick it up with the first drive, and there's the X-Man, Xavier Wishart. Remember him? He was the defensive MVP in the state title game. Jim Ned up 7-0. Second half, Indians trying to pull away. Tate Yardley to Brayden Lewis, who will cruise in from 47 yards. And Jim Ned is leading it 21-0. Then Cisco would battle back. They score 14 straight points, making this one score here. A one-score game with two minutes left to go in the fourth. And you're wondering, can they pull out the magic? But Wishart will take Jim Ned 37 yards to the house here for the touchdown to seal it. And the Indians remain unbeaten as they beat Cisco 28-14. Jim Ned has outscored opponents this year 174-55. to Can you say back-to-back? -back? Cisco, though, is a true definition of a 2A. Barely has 17 kids to practice every day. Let's get some reaction from the headliner in the big country from Austin Ivan. Coming into this season as the defending state champs, Jim Ned knew they were going to get everyone's very best shot each week. In the first three games of the season, though, no one was able to slow them down as they cruised to victories. And tonight, even though the scoreboard might show another double-digit victory, Coach Fanning said this was the exact test that his team needed. You know, I mean, we needed this. Uh, we, we talked about it all week, and that's, that's why we play these kind of clubs. And, you know, my hat goes off to Cisco. That's an outstanding ball club, uh, very well coached, ton of grit, really, really tough football team. Uh, and they put us in that situation and, and brought some of that out in us that we hadn't really been challenged with this year, and we needed that. Running back Xavier Wishart ran for 175 and two touchdowns tonight. After the game, Coach Fanning praised the senior for his vision out on the field. Uh, he's got, a, you know, he does. He's got outstanding vision. He sees the field, and he's relentless. He gets stronger as the game goes on, and, and when it's in crunch time, I mean, you want to put it in five hands. He's a, he's a great ball player. Day one, they teach you, 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 you read their butts. They go that way, you go the other way. And, I mean, also, you see a blitzer or something. It's just you see basket cuts, you bounce cuts. It's, it's just everywhere. Next week, Jim Ned will head out on the road to Snyder for their final tune-up before district play begins.